everyone. Welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, my name is Brandon. And my name is Heidi, and we're here with another video for you guys. Today is an interesting pin mail Monday because it isn't really pin mail, but it's something that we're gonna use for our pins. We have some stuff from Crack and Trade, and yeah. I'm really excited to get into this. So we ordered our stuff from Crackin' Up North, which is like the Canadian version of Crack and Trade. Yes. Brandon did all the like logistics here. Yes. But from my understanding, Sue is the one who runs this website yeah. and so she kind of the one who you like correspond with so she made sure that we got these products which is so awesome and here's her information on there if you're interested in getting any of this stuff facebook instagram email we'll leave her contact and the website in the description down below so we ordered the mega elites which are the biggest pin books that you can get from crack and trade mine's on top so i'm gonna reach in first you want to reach and in I'll and grab yours and yeah. we can just go and show them together let's do it because they are like the same thing but we got yes. them in different colors yeah so i'm really excited about i this. love it so these are the products that we got. So again, these are called the Mega Elites. These are like pin books. And the intention of this is that you can either store your pins in here. A lot of people use these when they're traveling to the parks, yep. like if they want to trade and stuff, cause you can flip through yeah. and have different pins in here. This is what it looks like on the inside. So what I think is cool is you can have like, like your favorite collection on the front mm -hmm. if you wanted to kind of be displayed through this little window. And then as you open, there's these kind of like, like foam, like little inserts that your yep. pins go on and then they flip over and there's a divider to protect the other pins underneath. And each Mega Elite has the three foam dividers and then three of the plastic dividers. But because we weren't sure how if it'll be enough would, room. Yeah, how many they would actually yeah, fit. We got some extra dividers and foam boards. Now I don't know if they're gonna fit inside because Sue had mentioned that these only fit like the three of them. Yeah. But I thought that we could have the extra ones to like put extra pins on, put them in like a binder if you wanted to maybe, yep. and then kind of store them somewhere else. Or maybe we can kind of make this work for them to fit inside. <laughs> also came with some clips mm -hmm. that you can clip on the sides right here, which is awesome if you wanted to kind of carry it around at the parks, or if you're like a super pin professional and you want to have like a super fun picture of you like like with all your pins. Yes, you could have it over your arm. Yes. But we'll also give you an up close look here. Yeah. So it has the crack and trade logo up there, uh, that K there and these are really, really like well made. They're yeah. awesome. And they actually have like two zippers down the side. So we took a closer look and we <laughs> also have this on the back. So the back part, you could actually store maybe one more of those things back oh, here. Oh yeah, you're right. That's a good idea. Because they have like a little pouch here that when you unzip it, I already nice. had opened it. You can put stuff in there, like maybe yep. extra backers pins that you maybe want to like trade quickly. Yeah. Or just, I don't know. Don't really care too much about can go back here. And then you could put another, um, Thing at the back and i feel like if you didn't actually put it in you could put another one at the front yes i think so too so i think that it will work for us for sure yeah so what we're gonna do we're gonna take some pins and put them on to show you what these look like yeah. with pins on the foam board these are the foam inserts that come inside of the binders so these are the ones that we got as extra and we'll yeah. just show you that they're really thick really so thick. when you put a pin in there like you gotta push them in there <laughs> and it's like that and they don't go through this so the whole intent is that maybe at the back that poke is actually probably for your yeah, backers for the, yeah and then you can uh put the pin in there and it doesn't poke through so it won't hurt the other pins in and there. then i put some pins on mine which i'm like loving how they look <laughs> and they're just kind of like like random pins of different sizes because i wanted to show you kind of what mm -hmm. that looks like so here's the front of mine right now and you can see the pins through but then when you open it up like there is quite a bit of room i don't yeah. know how many pins it actually fits but you can see some different ones the Judy Hops and the Seven Dwarfs one are pretty big. And then we have a hidden Mickey one there as well, just so you can kind of see the sizes. But I'm excited to get all of our pins in here and like yes. display them with our different collections. And for anyone who's curious of how much these are, in case that you want to get one for yourself, I'm going to read it off the email here that I got. So the refill inserts, which was these here, and it comes with three of them and the three dividers was $33. And for the Mega Elites, each of them, Heidi's was the Roy Blush and mine was the Mermaid Teal. They were $84 each. Now that's in Canadian dollars. Yes. So these are really cool. And the reason that we got these was because we're moving into a one bedroom apartment. And yeah. right now, currently, we probably have like five or six 
like pin boards. Yeah. And it's just not gonna be practical to hang up that many pin boards. So we thought that these are a good alternative. That's everything that we have for today. Let us know down below in the comments if you'd wanna see a pin collection video. We know we asked you guys about it before <laughs> and we didn't post one just because we didn't know how to film it. Yes. But now with these new Megalites, I feel like it'd be a really good opportunity to do one of those. Yes. Let us know that. And if you did enjoy this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new, consider subscribing for more Disney content just like this, pins, hauls, and unboxings, and be sure to ring that notification bell so you never miss a new video from us. And remember, it's always sunny.